Here goes for real this time. Raja Rabbit Revenge. Let's do it. Four million health. Four million health. We could do this. We could do this, man. We should be able to do this. It's just gonna take an extremely um, absurdly. I don't know why I use two adjectives. It's gonna take a really long time. Oh, I can't walk through those. Yeah, I need to do something about those leaves, bro. Hold up, hold up. <laughs> we need to break those leaves so I get more dodging room. So if it takes us about 30, 40 seconds to take out 80,000 health, okay? Let's say 40 seconds to take 80,000 health off of him. W what would be the math doing that with uh, 4 million? Somebody do the math. How, many, how long will this take? I'm assuming a couple minutes because he's got the same attacks. He doesn't seem like he's going to really switch up the pattern. This is more of just you know, a stamina test, the usual. About 16 minutes? There's no way. We're already at 3.5 million and it's been like, what, a minute maybe? This is a pretty easy fight. <laughs> Dude's just standing there. Oh, he hit me. Oh, no. Whatever will I do? I'm going to just do some gardening, you know? <laughs> so we're almost at 3 million and it's been like a minute, maybe two minutes. I like how the weapons are in his hands when he uses them. That's really cool. I like that. I'm going to call it now. He either kills us or he despawns. Now, I've wasted my time with worse stuff, so I'm not even too worried about wasting my time fighting him. We're about to hit 3 million, and it's been like 5 minutes. Oh, God. See, I'm playing with my right hand right now while my left hand is uh, opening the drawer. <laughs> okay, I'm about to play with one hand now. But I have to get a really good dodge. Oh. <laughs> Alright, I think that was a pretty good dodge. I was able to put my wrist thing on while fighting Raja. <laughs> Damn, the homing on that. That shit really got homing. It might kill me too. Jeez. I'm kind of scared of that attack now. Y'all seen that health? I wonder if we lost. Oh, I would have gave up if we lost. <laughs> For sure, I would have been done playing. I'm fighting Raja, switching hands, using my off, using my right hand. That's my dominant hand, actually. Using my right hand, putting on a, a wrist protector for my wrist, uh, texting my mom, looking at, at my phone. You no, know, this fight has been kind of a joke. I'm having uh, four million health. The scariest thing that happened in this fight is when he hit me with that javelin that did like a hundred a tick. So that's the only thing I'm really scared of. Is that even that though doesn't last long enough for uh, for him to kill us. FYI, this is a placeholder. He will get a real rematch, just not just a health boost. This is the Raja rematch. I don't know how much is gonna be in the, the video whenever I make a highlight video about this. Hey, at least the music is bumping. Sounds like some Mega Man music, some Mega Man stage music. Watch him do like a one hit attack at the end. Where he one hits you and he's like, haha, dumbass. <laughs> that would be disrespectful. Would have been over with a vanilla class. I don't know. Four million health? Maybe. Sorry if I don't sound enthusiastic. Uh, I've been talking for the last three hours straight, a majority of the three hours. So like, I'm sorry. Oh, whoa, whoa, calm down, man. Nearly one shot you. Cause you trying to? He trying to do that shit I was talking about, where he was trying to one shot me right at the end. You know, a good thing to have when fighting bosses, or you know, just being in a moment where you know there's some stakes. It's always nice to have that clutch gene and to not get nervous. You know what I'm saying? He almost one shot me. I always don't worry at all. There's no reason for me to get nervous. Cause if I kill him. I'm not getting much out of it. If he kills me, he's not getting much out of it. So it doesn't matter to me. We're almost done though. Once we get it to 80,000, you know, that's his regular health bar. Those, I think the missiles from his little like bunny bazooka, I feel like those hit really hard. I think that's the attack that almost one shot me. So far his javelins and his bazooka are the scariest thing about him. The carrots, no, not too bad. Him himself touching you, not too bad either. Now his throwable carrots, look, even I just got hit by the bazooka. It did like a hundred, maybe doing javelins now the thing with the javelins we gotta watch out for is just timing on when he throws it so when he throws one that's when we you know switch sides i like how i'm like giving out strategies at the end of the fight like it don't matter <laughs> it's the end of the fight finesse my way through those carrots oh i didn't see that one here we go we're gonna we're almost at 80,000. oh we're about to hit 80,000. this is the guaranteed like 40 second range it took to fight him but yes sir i can officially say that i have defeated some of the titans in terraria besides spirit of purity rematch i've defeated supreme cal i have defeated spirit of chaos spirit of purity and i have defeated raja rabbit revenge form i have defeated raja rabbit's revenge there you go that's on better for the video i doubt that he actually drops any better better loot yeah he doesn't this is just one of the things he already drops it's all good we just have the video proof that we killed him raja rabbit mask baby that's what we were here for look at the fit boys
This is the fit you wear after you slaughter a fucking god amongst peasants. What you think about that, Raja? Oh, you can't think about nothing because you're fucking dead. What? There's wings? That's cool as hell. Rabbit copter wings? We can't even see it because of his hat. Ooh, this is cool. I like this. I like these. But there you go. Raja has been defeated. He cut off the head of Raja and wore it. Hell yeah. All right, you ready? Whoever guesses how many souls we get from this wyvern, you get your name. You'll be the last name with all the donators and all the contest winners, and you just get to be on here, all right? So don't guess how many souls yet until I type in a message saying that you should start guessing. Okay. You ready? You guys ready for this? Message coming up now. All right, enter your answers. How many souls do you think I have? I'll give you three, two, one. It's 50 souls. People are guessing like 16 and 20. I don't think anyone got 50. There's someone really close though. Yeah, nobody got 50. We gotta do it again. There's somebody really close though. I think someone named Josh was really close. I think Josh said 49. <laughs> yeah, well, I told you guys I was gonna do three wyverns. Why did you guys guess so little? <laughs> Give you five seconds. Five, four, two, three, one. I like how someone said, I am a dumb human being. All right. It's 52, it's 52, let's see here. I see a 59, a 50, 56, 53. I don't think I see a 52. Gotta go again. So we know it's like somewhere in the 50s so far, it seems the uh, average. Five, one, four, two, three. All right, 48 is the magic number. And we got 48, Yidikis. Yidikis was the third one to say something, Yidikis. It was Waluigi, Dav, and then Yidikis. Damn! Waluigi, Dav, and Yidikis were all right next to each other. Waluigi said 47, Dav said 49, and Yidikis said 48. Damn, good job, Yidikis. Yidikis gets his name in the world. The last person to get their name in the world. I should show you guys. Yeah, I'm gonna show you guys an example of what we're gonna do for the next series for uh, people that donate. We're gonna make a little box. And in the little box, we're gonna put, you know, whoever's name, the name of the person that donated. We're gonna put your name in the box. So yeah, you donate, boom, you get your little name in there. Maybe I'll expand it one block and put a torch in there. And then on top of this, okay, we, we're gonna make, say like, Yeet wants a statue of a dick. Yeetikis wants a statue of a dick on top of his donation too. We'll make a statue of a dick. This is how I'm gonna do it next series though is that once you donate you get, you get a little extra you get not only your name in the world but you get a little statue with your name like a man handmade statue built <laughs> there you go we'll probably have like a certain amount we'll say like if you donate two dollars you get the statue and then if you donate above two you get the rest does it look weirder now that i added curves to it one weird looking guitar yeah it kind of looks like a guitar now that i look at it it's like a mickey mouse themed guitar shout out to omega jd pyro Amilda, Mossy, Shazam, Oreo, It's a Hill, Outdated, Frostfire, Kiru, Fuck, One Through Five. Uh, we got Saf right here, that guitar, Pig, Vampire, Juiced, Gamingkin, Texas, Cash Money, CBT, Unusual, and of course, the last of them all, the win the last competition, Yeet. Yeet. <laughs> See, if you're one of the people that have joined and only started watching me because of my one-off videos, you know, you don't know nothing about this because you haven't seen the actual series. You haven't seen the actual Terraria series I've done. But this is my orc family tree. And, uh, you know, we start at the beginning here. The uh, parents, the dad, and the mom of all the orcs. Just that we don't know who they are. Maybe they're going to be in a future series or something. Maybe they'll be in the next season. If I if I even do seasons. Uh, and then we got my boy right here. Uncle Karius. Obviously the brother to the dad orc. Uncle Karius. So we don't know who his wife is. But we do know the little information given recently. Information given by me recently. Uncle Karius. Did not breed. Is that the right word to use? <laughs> Did not have babies with another orc it wasn't another orc it could have been an animal it could have been just another race that isn't an orc so that, there, there's uncle Karius. we go down the line here of the og mom and dad orc we got right here david the mage casminicus the bard larkis the summoner nunderson the thrower book is dead but book the ranger and grognek grognek's the only character i haven't done a series of well there's two characters actually and then we go down the line casminicus he had a son named jasminicus these two are great musicians but yeah now we go down the line of uncle Carius right here you see uncle Carius we get down his line boom we get down to these two three we got she and he there's a light healer and dark healer but then we got this guy we, we don't know who this is <laughs> all we know is that he's wearing the mystic armor set from the mystic class in the enigma mod right he's just known as the unknown orc slash secret orc we go down here to cousins slash people that are also related to the orc family uh obviously we're missing a couple 
We got Tremonicus. You know, he was a brave boy to tackle the uh, Tremor series, and uh, he's dead. <laughs> but he might have had an offspring that will tackle the Tremor series yet again. Well, we will see. We got Dragon Balzacus. You know, Dragon Balzacus, great series. I had a lot of fun playing him. Do you like Terraria? Nah, I just played all the day because I'm forced to. 